Right, a very good evening. Uh, we are at the last day of our trip and probably one of the best. It's Universal Halloween Horror Night. Excited. Excited is an understatement. Um, we, yeah, we both love horror and there's so many uh, great mazes here tonight. So many and, um, scare zones. Have a nice last year in the land or didn't we? Yeah. If you like scare zones, this is probably the best the, the best theme. Maybe not the scariest, yeah, but scary. definitely up there is the best themed. Uh, obviously, as well as Orlando's. We've never done the Hollywood one, but we did Orlando last year and we loved it, didn't we? It's really good. Yeah. So you've got uh, nine mazes tonight, including the Terror Trap and uh, some scare zones. And Stacey's all kitted out yeah. in a new T-shirt. So I'll show you the mazes. You've got. Stranger Things, Blumhouse, Trick or Treat, The First Purge, Halloween 4, The Walking Dead, which is a permanent attraction here, but they include it as a maze tonight. The Universal Monsters with Frankenstein, Dracula, etc. Poltergeist, meant to be a really good maze, can't wait for that one. And of course, the Terror Tram, where the, um, it's the, the Backlot Studio too, isn't it? The Transform it for Horror Nights and there's you know, things like Killer Clowns and stuff like that in there. Yeah, so it's going to be brilliant. I'm actually wearing a men's a, a large t-shirt yeah. and it's about $30 isn't it? Yeah, $30. I just thought I'd wear it She's changed it into a long dress. Oh. So yeah, it, the time actually is now about 20 past 5. We have been in the park all afternoon. Yeah, we're just making our way down the escalators now to the back lot because uh, yeah, is the it lower the, lot. the lower lot? The sorry, lower lot. because uh, five of the mazes are actually open early. Um, it's about yeah, so it's about twenty past five. So for the first couple of hours, they're open early. I think we should gonna try and use our um, we'll just walk in first, and then we'll use our. Yeah, we have got ex there. yeah we've got express for tonight. It How does get really express? busy, and it is a Friday night. I can't remember now. It's about hundred and fifty odd dollars each. I think each. it's definitely worth it if you come in like once, like we are. Yeah. Obviously if you live around the area then you wouldn't need it as much as you can come because of time, can't you? Well yeah, so we've got the Express, so for the first couple of hours... Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Halloween Hornets 2018. For those of you who are joining us on the Starway right now, we highly recommend that you check out Poltergeist, the maze or trick or treat to access these mazes, walk towards Transformers and maybe right. right. If you want to check out any of the wait times for the mazes tonight, we highly recommend... I need to find out where we're going. Yeah. So you got, yeah, down here you've got Poltergeist, Trick or Treat, their Blumhouse, all these are open early so we're going to go and do a, a couple without Express. Yeah, we've also got Express for the rides, you've got The Mummy, uh, Transformers is on. Yeah, it's going to be really good tonight. What maze are you looking forward to the most? Probably it's Poltergeist, yeah. Stranger Things. Halloween. No, not as much. Yeah. Yeah, I think they're all going to be amazing. But yeah, we're going to get to the first maze and show you when we get there. Right, first maze of the night, trick or treat. On a five minute wait, let's go. Right, maze number one, trick or treat. Yeah, really good horror film this one. Hopefully there's a good few scenes. Um, it's actually a scare zone as well, and it was a zone at Orlando last year. And there's the first scare of the night, it took three seconds. Oh, 
start. Yeah. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. I'm going the wrong way. Yeah, excellent, Mazer. Very good. Um, yeah. You like the film as well, don't you? Yeah, I enjoyed the film. It's yeah. like a cheesy, but like cheesy, scary horror. Yeah, loads of great uh, scares in there. Really good um, Just scenes. Put loads there. Yeah. Right, on to maze number two, let's go. Right, maze number two, Stranger Things, 15 minutes. You like the show, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, we've only seen the first season, but <laughs> we need to watch the second. But yeah, let's get on it.
this one's got Truth or Dare and Unfriended, obviously both Blumhouse films. The Orlando version has Happy Death Day and The First Purge. The First Purge here is a separate maze. Let's see what this one's about. I wasn't a huge fan of Truth or Dare. The actual maze might be good. Number four, we're doing Poltergeist because it's only on 15 minutes. 
Um, the, as, you, as you can see there, the purge was 25, so we'll do this and then we'll probably have a little break, get some food, and then we'll start using our express when it's a little bit darker. Maybe I going into the polar guys? down wait for it to get a bit darker like i say we've done four mazes in about an hour an hour and 15 minutes but obviously i just want to wait until later until it gets yeah. To the end. and then we'll make use of the express pass so yeah really good night here tonight i can't wait for it to get dark he'll be even more scared <laughs> Zones have opened. 
This is the uh, trick or treat scare zone as you walk through the main entrance. He's got a prodigy on his rock. This, this is by far the, the best horror event. This is a landmark. Yeah, you need to come and do this. So Halloween's open now, it's already on a 40 minute queue. And we've we on the way out. Oh. We saw a little girl crying as well, didn't we? Yeah. Also on the way out we saw that it's open till 2 p.m. Yeah, but it's actually two, so we'll be here to the very end. Got to make the most of it on our last day. Absolutely loads of roaming actors. Yeah. So the um, oh, Universal Monsters Maze is open. That's only on 15 at the minute. That's too bad. Yeah, there's that mini school bus. Yeah, yeah, the werewolf. Yeah, really good. The fire effect. Yeah, amazing event. I'm not sure. Oh. Yeah, I'm not sure what maze we're doing now, but <laughs> we're gonna head on round. Get on maze number five. Universal Horror Night. Right, maze number five. Halloween four. Excited? Yeah. I absolutely love the Halloween franchise. I really, I quite enjoy the fourth film as well. Uh, obviously, you've got the remake. Not the remake. The um, sequel to the original coming out next month. Can't wait for that. <laughs>
What do you think? It's okay. Just okay. Probably well, the weakest maze of the night. That's my opinion. Really? Yeah, I think so. Like I, I like the films, but I just I don't know. It was just him popping out. But yeah. I didn't find it that gets scary. a bit repetitive. Yeah, but if you know what's coming, it's going to be him again, like popping out. Yeah. It's a good maze, yeah. obviously. Yeah, no, I can see what she means. Um, but as a, a huge fan of the franchise, I love that. Um, but there were some really good scenes in there. Really good jump scares. Yeah, really good. Um, said 35 minutes, but with Express, we run straight away, weren't we? So it is worth the money when it gets busy like this. Um, right, maze number six, let's go.
really good, wasn't it? I love that. I think it's my favorite of the night. Yeah? I think it's my favorite of the night. Yeah, I'd put that up there. Yeah, we're coming out. Oh. We're coming here. We're getting here. Yeah, we're not coming yet. Brilliant. Yeah, I'd put that up there with all the guys that are here for the night. Some really good set scenes in there. Obviously, it was all of the classical Universal monsters. Over the night, excellent maze. Right, um, we're doing really well. We've done seven out of the nine I think mazes. We might go and do the ter terror tram now, well, really. we've got the purge and the terror tram left. Let's see the shore there. So yeah, the map, see the shore. Right? Yeah, yeah, really good night here. Right, maze number eight. This is, you don't get this at the Orlando one, do you? This is like exclusive to Hollywood. Yeah. Obviously, doing the studio too, which we did earlier in the day. Norman Bates obviously comes out, but here we're right up and close to it. There's so much to look at. These are just sports a little over there. He's getting killed. Oh, oh that was excellent, that. <laughs> that was killing him. <laughs> yeah, you got sprayed with water there. Yeah, these are all like uh, cannibals, obviously. Maybe <laughs> in the next scene. Remember the 
remember this guy from his uh, Orlando last Happy year? Hold it for the film set. Yeah. Yeah, really good maze, one of the best. Sorry, we're having some technical difficulties so here. Back now. We oh, only have making it worse. Happening. That's going to have to do. Um, so as we head back, what's going on here? Oh no 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 no! I don't think it's. Is it over yet? Five is over. Five is over. It's okay, I barely liked them anyways. Um, for you horror movie fans on board, you probably... So we're making our way now to the last maze we need to do. The um, first purge, yeah. It's got a two hour queue at the minute, doesn't it? I know. But I'm not too sure why, because I didn't think it'd be one of the most popular mazes. Yeah, Stranger but Things would yeah. be the most popular. Yeah, but apparently, yeah, the first purge is the most popular maze here. Yeah, um, we've actually just been on the mummy twice, which was really good used. That's uh, okay. <laughs> well, yeah, I prefer the Orlando one. I if, when you were like before, you went down backwards. Yeah, like, it's a there is a quite. It is a bit jolly. It's still a good ride. Yeah, so we did that. We also did um, the Stranger Things maze just then with our Express. We'll come back and do Trick or Treat on the way back up, but we're heading down to the first purge, and also down here there's Blumhouse. Yeah, it's got a lot busier. Uh, Blumhouse and Poltergeist. So we'll do those again. Obviously it's pointless filming again, it's, it's already in the vlog, but yeah, we get Poltergeist, so yeah, get to maze number 9. So we're just heading to the 
village now and here's one of the scare zones, Toxic Tunnel. Oh no. Oh, oh god, look at them all. Well this is good for the walk that we did earlier. Yeah. It's good though, isn't it?
Poltergeist is on nearly an hour. Yeah, um, make, yeah, gonna make use of our express now. Obviously, no point filming the mazes again. So, yeah, we'll record a bit later on. We'll do some footage of the show yeah. we're seeing at the end of the really night. enjoyed this maze earlier. Yeah. I think we've got this one, uh, Trick or Treat, Blumhouse again. Yeah, so we'll do all them and then see you at the show. the show it starts at half 12 things about quarter past now um i don't really know much about these do you they're quite famous and yeah vegas and travel i don't know well i don't know if it's vegas but they are quite famous um they're meant to be really good so yeah really looking forward to seeing it um yeah we haven't filmed for quite a while we've we've done all the mazes again pretty much haven't we like uh, poltergeist and um trick or treat Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, really good. So, yeah, um, I'll show you some highlights of the show and then we'll be leaving the park. But, yeah, really good event tonight.
the morning, we're walking out now. How puts it? Monsters was brilliant, like really, really, really good. Stranger Things, just for the theme in the set, the effects, just walking through it was really fantastic. And also Poltergeist as well. I love that maze, it's really good. What were yours? Um, for me, I'd say Top Maze Poltergeist was absolutely brilliant. Some of the scenes in there were yeah. phenomenal. Um, I also really loved the Universal Monsters. Um, that was great. And number three, I'm gonna go with Halloween, just because Halloween. I love the, yeah, I love the franchise. So it, was, it was good to see all the sets in there. But that, like Strange Things is brilliant as well. Like most of the mazes were fantastic. They were, yeah. yeah. I'd say the weakest one's probably Walking Dead and Blumhouse. Blumhouse, yeah. definitely. Yeah. So, still good mazes. Still so. good. Overall, it's been a fantastic event. Like as expected, mm -hmm. just like last year in Orlando, the brilliant events. So. The only thing I would say that. I didn't enjoy as much as there was the, like a lack of food. Yeah, yeah. obviously you get pizza fries and all that. Pizza though. fries are amazing. <laughs> so we, we were hoping they'd be here, but they weren't. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so obviously um, we fly home tomorrow, but we've done so much over the last two weeks. Like we did the Pacific Coast Highway, which was beautiful. Disneyland was great because we got on loads of rides, didn't we? Yeah, six flags. the Hollywood side. Climb the Hollywood side. Yeah, it's been an amazing trip and can't stress enough, come out here in September because most of the parks are dead. They if are. you go, go on a weekday, they're dead. Um, yeah. yeah it's, it's, and the weather's great. Yeah, brilliant. Yeah, so we're going to wrap it up now and we hope you've enjoyed the past few vlogs that we've done. And obviously there's a lot more to come on the channel. So yeah, I hope you um, will like and subscribe for more. Yep.